All right, class, pick up your scalpels. It's so sad. Gretchen, your frog lived a long and happy life, filled with triumphs. I remember last month that even looking at a starfish made you sick. Do you need a bucket? Yes, Savannah. Today I'm pretty comfortable with a knife. Ooh, very nice, Miss Blake. Very nice. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, um, it's okay. I'm a sad on anatomy, he's a master of dissection, an expert chef who wheels an expert knife. But still I sense a gremlin in the system of perfection. There clearly are some mysteries of life. It's kingdom phylum class and then it's order family genus. It all comes back to me like child's play. Ah, he leans over my shoulder there and all his long and leanness. It cuts my heart and knowledge clean away. Clean away. Try to keep a focused mind and steady hand. Who keeps focused? Who keeps steady? The rhythm of my heart is like a country western band. Whoa, 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 oh. oh. Biology, what have you done to me? Why can't my corner brain control my teenage parts? Oh. Yeah, Ellie, check it. <laughs> Man. He's inert and inarticulate, a specimen of truant. Though we're both 16, he's much too young. Much too young. My amygdala is fully formed, my frontal lobe is fluent, the pheromones go futzing with my tongue. That's totes amaze, I'm way impressed, like sweet technique. Holy cow! Like totally um, thanks. Does this lab work great? Poor Kermit there, he has no chance. That girl is on my nerves today. I better set her straight. <laughs> it's fun to make a dead frog dance. I never knew that Ellie Blake was such a science whiz. She's smart, of course, so it makes sense. But something's up with her today. I don't know what it is. She's like on fire. She's so intense. Please help me if you can, please hear my painful